Hey guys, and welcome back to Haunting Ground. When we last left off, we were trying to get uh, our dog, Huey, down here. Uh, we were also trying to trigger one of the more interesting uh, deaths in the game. However, apparently we can't actually lure the maid down here with us because uh, this room currently is classed as a puzzle room and enemies can't follow you into puzzle rooms apparently uh, which I actually remember reading now the trouble is as soon as you actually complete a puzzle in a puzzle room it's no longer classed as a puzzle room so there's that now we need to find our dog so we're actually pretty safe hello you Yes, you are a pain. We know you're a pain. And what have you done with my dog? Huey. Huey. Seriously, Huey? Like, where have you gone, bud? It's kind of important that you hang around me. Alright? I need you for a puzzle. Um, this is awkward. <laughs> uh, Huey. <laughs> Huey. I don't need you, buddy. You can't keep disappearing on me, okay? We've, we've, we've spoken about this, lad. I need you to come to me, come with me, I should say, uh, to the torture chamber. Promise you it's not quite as harrowing as it sounds. Yep, come on, Huey. Come on, buddy. Come on. Look. Yes. Ah, oh, okay. That's awkward. Wait. Oh, okay. There she is. Yeah, not sure how these mirrors work because they certainly don't seem to distract her. Uh, maybe I should look those up as well, but I don't want to keep looking stuff up because you know, self-discovery is part of the fun. Uh, maybe, maybe Huey is through here. I mean, I'm pretty sure we did have him in here last time. Let's try and hide in the corner. See if that works. Yeah, this is kind of... No, look, she's going to run straight into us. Which is a problem. She's a bastard like that. Oh, nope. <laughs> I was going to say we'll hide behind the door. No such luck. Run, run. It's fine. It's fine. Just keep, just keep running. Just keep running. Oh, d really? You had to fall down there, didn't you? You. Uh, now we're going to panic. This is going to be potentially really nasty. Unless. Oh God. This is the last room we want to be in with her. And. <sighs> That's all, folks. Well, Fiona, kind of hard to feel sorry for you there. Now, where did I... Oh, okay. We actually did put down a save state, so kind of grateful about that. Ah, uh, we've... Yes. Come on, Huey. Come on. Come on, boy. Come on. Come on. We know that Come we're on. safe in here. Come on. Yeah, now when I first started playing this, I really did think that Huey would stick with you. I, I never really um, envisioned Huey would be this totally separate entity that literally would just up and fuck off whenever he wants. Um, trying to think. Come on. Where we had him last? Now, I don't. Miss. Hello. I ah right. Okay, so she actually locked him away. That. Kind of makes a little bit more sense, I suppose. 
Uh, Huey, no, buddy, buddy, this way. Yeah, we could probably defeat her if we put our mind to it, but we don't need to. Huey, come on, dude. Come on, man. Work with me here. You're supposed to be making our experience through this easier, but you're actually making it significantly harder. Oh, you need some discipline, really, but... Right, now you, come with me. For God's sakes. Alright, so, we need to do this puzzle now. Look, I know you're growling because she's near, and she's literally outside, not that door, the other door further on but come on. she can't come in here come on. all right she literally cannot come in here because um this is a puzzle room that's actually interesting one of the side effects of her shutting all these doors is she can actually stop huey from following you um mm, i that's unexpected and actually really quite interesting anyway Let's get this going, shall we? Huey, come on. Come on, come on buddy. Come on. come on. Now, I did have a decent amount of challenge with this. Come on. Trying to get him to actually stand on the right no. blocks. Stay. Right, stay. Okay, stay on that. Come on. Sit. Stay. Right, okay. Well, we can't tell him to sit, but we can tell him to stay. Uh, okay, so that's one down. Now we need red and yellow. There we go, there's two done. Now, it was green and blue. Well, I think he actually <laughs> screwed that up, but it worked in our favour. Yeah fat-footed dog feet push both at once which apparently works I'm happy with this Oof. Now, what I'm going to do... Now, technically, this room isn't a puzzle room, so I'm going to drop a save. Because I want to try and trigger that death, if possible. Right, so we've got the Venus. Alright, let's see... If we can go get her... Attention. Now, where is she? Come on. She might be through there. There's a shut door. There's a good chance. No, I guess she's not through here. Bugger. Which means, yeah, because that goes to the graveyard. I hope <laughs> I'm trying to work out whether this death's actually even worth us pursuing. Ah, oh, I know where she is. I know how we can get her to spawn. Oh, she's down. She's fiddling with that, yeah. Alright, well, we don't want to upgrade her with a poker. So, let's go over this side. See if we can open this door. Because in theory, in she will be in here. Yes, cool. Alright, so you can manipulate the AI a little bit once you understand how it works. I'm not sure how she constant, constantly teleports around. Come on, you. No, Huey, don't attack her. Don't attack her, Huey. We, we, need, we need her to follow us. Okay, Huey. Stop being a goit. God, this better be worth it. Right. Come on, this way, woman. Through here. Yes, right, she's actually proper following us this time. Can we hide in here with her? No. Now she's going to be really 
bloody awkward. And she's going to be too far on her ass to actually trigger this quote unquote hidden death. Uh, how to slow her down? Not really sure how we can slow her down. Unless. Right, Huey, attack her. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Now. Now she's still coming. So, in theory, we can hide. Really? Man, that is a really. You have to get incredibly lucky to see that death. Or maybe incredibly unlucky to see that death. Depending on how. Depending on how you want to look at it. Right. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Now, if she doesn't actually activate the thing, then I don't know what to tell you guys. Ooh. She still didn't do it. Coast clear. Hmm. Oh. Oh, she tricked us. That was cool. Yeah, more stuff like that. Game. Lots more stuff like that, please. Huey. Right, Huey. Now, can we... Can we fake her out again? I wonder. There we go. Right. Nope. Right. Huey, attack. Huey, attack. Huey. There we go. Right. Now, let's try it, shall we? Yeah, I think I'm just going to literally waste this entire video trying this. Uh, come on. It should not be this difficult. <laughs> I swear it should not be this difficult. Maybe there's some like really obvious silly thing that I'm doing that would make this way easier. Not sure. Yeah, it's not happening. No. You know what? Screw it. I'll just... I'll try and find it online. And I'll see if I can patch it in. She is injured, though. Huey, attack. Come on, Huey. Attack. There we go. Let's see if we can do some damage to her. Like so. You know what? That's what we need. Now, Huey... Where are you? Hey, buddy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Come on, let's go. Okay, so anyway, we got ourselves a nice fancy new key. Uh, let's feed Huey. Just because. Uh, what have we got here? Restores a small amount of stamina. That's no good. What can we feed Huey? I guess we'll give him that. Not sure if that's could be considered a waste, but you know he's happy. So 
Whatever. We don't care. As long as our dog's happy, that's all that matters. Now, after that escapade, we should be able to go through here. The door is locked. Well, we have the Venus key. So let's go. Now you might recognize this little area. Yeah, those mandrakes, man, they're pretty horrendous, to say the least. Nasty things. This is an info sheet on the... Is this an info sheet on the plants here? There is something written here. In order to procure the large quantity of blood required to complete the grand process, a fusion of plant and animal known as the flora, uh, flora mammalia was created. It was originally derived from a secret formula and named the Mandragoria. Multiple plant types were fused in an attempt to create the Mandragoria, but the combination, but only the combination of evil seemed to possess a similar liquid composition. In current research, our subjects are nearly identical to a real Mandragoria. Flower color and an ever so faint difference in smell is the only way to tell the original part from the substitute. Caution must be exercised if the Mandragoria is ever uprooted. It has two powerful defense mechanisms. It emits a loud ear rupturing shrek and can paralyze its attacker with poisonous leaves. If the situation becomes too dangerous, one should quickly, quickly throw away the Mandragoria to get out of harm's way. I have a feeling, although I, I never actually tried this, if we hit the save, save slot. Right, so we've got choices here of all these different colours, right? Let's try pulling one at random. So that makes us panic, which is curious. Very curious. Ah, yeah, right, otherwise known as Flora Mammalia, yellow flowers bloom from its synthetic, from the synthetic plant, its screams and its poisons are known for slowly driving a victim insane, uh, we don't actually want that one because it's not the one we need, oh, here's our friend, This is not fantastic. She's coming straight for us. She's coming straight for us. Right, we need to get rid of her as quick as we can. Go get her. Go get her. Go get her. There you go, Huey. Right, we need to get rid of this bitch now. I think... Ah, we are actually slowly turning mad, so... Uh, what do we have? What can we use? Is it these? Right, now completely reduces panic. Ideal. So let's try and take this bitch out. Hopefully we can at least drop her. Because if we can drop her here and get away from her, we can come back. Not sure. Ah, she's injured. She is injured. Which is nice. As we can see here, attacking her is actually... Attack Huey! Jesus! Man, that's hard. There we go. Come on. Just keep working the bitch over. Unfortunately, our dog has taken some rather horrible... 
bits of damage there. Okay, we actually got a shit item as well. Right. Ah, uh, we can't pick it up. So we actually need to grab a white one. But we shall explain the process. Ooh, I wonder. Right, we can't actually hide behind that door, unfortunately. But we know we can hide here. Which is useful. So you can see, with all these little powers and all these little tricks that we have, we can actually legitimately fight back now. But it is... It is not... Um, a guaranteed win for us. It's absolutely made it a, a possibility. But you still have to be careful. These earrings are really useful. <laughs> because instead of having to run away, sometimes... Huey, you need to just chill out. And Huey's attacking her. Yeah. Huey... I am wondering if it's worth trying to take her out again, but I don't want to use all of our anti-panic meds. Because we know, the trouble is, as soon as we run out of those, we're hosed. Alright. I think she's gone for now. I did like that little trick she pulled where she can psych us out and actually close the door but wait behind the door. Now Huey is probably taking some awful damage there. Uh, so let's feed him up. Now these yeah these are the ones that we really don't want to be feeding him. Yeah they make him angry. So maybe we should be discarding these. Because although they turn him psycho and apparently you know, make him um, quite the, the tough boy. We really don't want to do that. Re yeah, see, that restores a small amount of dog stamina. Right, that completely restores the stamina and makes him happy. Right, okay, so beef jerky and the magna esca are basically exactly the same thing. So let's give him some beef jerky. What do you mean you can't use that here? Oh, Huey. Huey. Huey, we actually need you here, to be honest, boy. Uh, beef jerky. Right, let's give him some... <sighs> we can use it here. Sit. Right. There we go. We actually have to be really close to him to use that. Sweet. Right, that's going to make him happy. Now, after all that chaos, you remember... Uh, the perfume we got given. We can actually use that on Huey. And Huey is going to use his superior sniffing ability to sniff out the plant we need. I don't know what happens if we give him the wrong plant. So let's grab up one of these. Like so. Unfortunately. Is that going to call her? Yes. Here she comes. Hopefully we can hide here in the corner. Hopefully. does seem to be working at the moment. It is a little bit ropey. It's actually quite tense standing here in the corner because I know this isn't an exact science. I kind of want to take her out as well, to be honest, because I want to get some more medallions from her, but... I know that doesn't always pan out in our favour. So, we have what we want.
Now you're... Oh no, is she faking us out? Nope. She's actually not faking us out. I also think... Uh, yeah. Yeah, so just having this thing in our possession, I think, is driving us crazy. So we need to be as quick as we possibly can. I knew she was waiting. I bloody knew it. So now we need to go to the graveyard, which was this way, I think. Yes, this way. Cool. Now, unfortunately, ooh, she's chasing me. Ooh. Right, let's quickly, if we read this, it's going to tell us that we need to do stuff. Looks to be a mausoleum. There are words written here. Dead spirit craving for life, crawling back from the underworld. Sip of the fresh flowing lifeblood when your thirst is quenched. Return to the darkness from whence you came. So yeah, we need to give our friend. It's too dark to see. Looks like there could be something in the back. Focus your eyesight on the object. Aye. <gasps> so, now he wants an item. You better believe we're going to give him the white man uh, mandragoria which is going to make him a little bit happy with us. So that was kind of cool. So, we've given him what we need. Unfortunately, we do have one of those beasts around here. We've got some beef jerky, which is nice. I think somewhere around here as well. Go. We can get Pooch to find something else. Not at oh, Sounds like trouble might be on the way. I'll tell you what we're going to do, though. If I put this on another save slot, say three, if we load save slot zero, which actually takes us there. Right, so if we reload this save slot, let's see what happens if we give the wrong one. Definitely curious at this. Uh, right. Yeah, we've got to catch up on her journal as well. Um, let's go for... Where is it? There it is. Yeah, out of curiosity. What happens if we feed the wrong thing to our friendly neighborhood ghoul? Maybe he becomes not so friendly. Let's have a little look. At least this area is somewhat safe. Right. So I'm guessing it... Oh, come on. I'm guessing it doesn't really matter what we feed to him. It's either going to work or it isn't. But I'm guessing only the white flowers seem to work. <laughs> yellow. Let's give him yellow. Yeah, buddy. What do you think of this? Is it lip smacking good? Ooh.
So no. <laughs> Basically, if you give them the wrong one, it doesn't seem too terribly dangerous. But I get the feeling that if I just go around poking my hands in places they shouldn't be, I could get sucked right on in. It's almost as if it wants something. There are traces as if something recently has been ripped to shreds here. It looks rather dried out, but I think this is a plant of sorts. Yeah. <laughs> so, that's what happens. Yeah, it just blocks our um, access to it. Which is interesting. I was hoping maybe we would get horribly murdered or something, but I guess not. Anyway, guys, I'm going to have to leave it there because we are out of time. Um, this has been an interesting romp through the graveyard and uh, the gardens growing these mandragoria things. Kind of interesting. There's a little bit of everything uh, involving alchemy with this game and... Uh, I like it. I'm really, really enjoying this. So, when we come back, guys, well, I guess we're going to push further. Further onwards. Hopefully find a way of getting rid of Daniela, because she's starting to outgrow her welcome. So, till then, guys. Till then.